Alright guys, so uh, last year in you know, December, I told myself that I was going to stay between 7 and 10 percent body fat year round this year. So pretty much once I got down to that, I was just going to hold that. Um, and if you look at the pictures, so that picture on the left, that's me at like 270 pounds, just coming off a holidays and bulking, so I was pretty chunky. And then the picture on the right, that's six months later, but the truth is I've been that lean since like, you know, March. So, um, you know, I've pretty much been maintaining the low body fat, you know, the majority of the year. So basically what I wanted to talk to you guys about today is how to maintain, you know, your results because you know a lot of people they focus on oh I'm gonna do this in 12 weeks oh I'm gonna lose 100 pounds you know the fitness industry is always throwing these extreme goals at you you know change 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 but you know nobody ever really wants to talk about how do you stay okay so here's the secret and it's not being perfect year round the secret is balance. What I mean by balance is you have to realize that sometimes you're going to screw up on your diet. There might be weeks you don't go to the gym, but the important thing is, you know, if you miss five days of workouts, that next Monday you're back at it again. You know, you just pick up where you left off. There's no, oh my God, it's the end of the world. You know, you just have to keep pushing through because the truth is, you know, this is lifestyle and part of life is road bumps. You know, you just, you can't be a hundred percent about everything all the time. So, you know, that's how I stay on track. Um, I mean, just like a month ago, I didn't work out for like four days and I eat like garbage, but the next week, you know, I was back to it and looked even better than the week before. You know, just because, you know, I listened to my body, I chilled out on my diet, on my working out, on my cardio. And when I started hitting it again, my cortisol was a lot lower, so I got better results. So guys, like, that's the secret, secret you know, if you want to make this a long-term thing, don't obsess about being perfect, okay? Just obsess about you know, getting back on the bandwagon when you fall off. That's all that matters is that you start back up again when you stop, okay? You know, and don't do not do this like, you know, oh, I'm gonna stop for a month thing, you know, it's gonna be, you know, you can give yourself a week off here and there, but you know, you just can't totally neglect the lifestyle or else you're gonna be right back where you started. So yeah, um, and then, Besides that, you know, you just have to do it. <laughs> you know, I think 90% of the time I go to the gym, I don't want to be there. Uh, I hate ground turkey. Uh, like, I really, I really hate dieting. Like, I'd rather eat pizza and burgers all day, but, you know, I like having abs and I like how I look when I don't have clothes on. Um, so that's why I eat that stuff because it's not about, you know, short term pleasures. It's about long term fulfillment and being satisfied with, you know, where you're at in life and really and truthfully loving your body, not just telling yourself that you do. All right, guys. So, um, yeah, happy 4th, and don't forget my 50% off sale on my Lean Bolt and Booty Blast. Plus, you know, there's my 21-day challenge giveaway. First prize is a $300 gift card, and you can just click the link below for more info on that.